my name is Richard Jenkins. I come from Ecolution, which is a uh, distributor and installer in the UK. I think um, people are very surprised uh, to hear that solar is uh, very successful in the UK and uh, certainly in the southern part of the UK we have a similar irradiation to uh, the irradiation found in Germany so uh, we, we do have perhaps more sunshine than people realise. Uh, LG, our relationship with LG originally started uh, when we were in a partnership with a German distributor called Havi Energy and uh, we were the first company to take LG panels in the UK so we have a long history with LG um, and, and a, you know, a good relationship with the company. Uh, there is uh, one uh, big thing about working with LG in the UK and that is the strength of the LG brand. LG in the UK is a very, very strong um, consumer electronics brand and uh, is uh, certainly one of the strongest brands in the solar market. So for us that's very important. Um, and that together with the quality of the product means that uh, LG are a very strong company to work with. So, um, we uh, recently completed a large housing project with LG uh, where we supplied uh, several hundred houses with, with LG panels. Um, and the support we received from LG was very, very good. So we've had a very good experience with LG. I think in the UK, um, people perhaps were sceptical about the effectiveness of solar, but in the last three to four years, uh, firstly, we have seen a, a very good performance from solar arrays, they, they generally overproduce, so uh, it has a very, very good reputation in the UK. That together with the falling cost of installing PV means that uh, certainly from the UK point of view we see a very good market in the years ahead. So we have a very positive outlook for solar uh, in the UK. Yes, I think uh, the UK will look to the work that's been done in Germany. But um, if it works in Germany and the costs, I think, need to come down um, for it to be, uh, uptake, you know, the uptake to be uh, bigger than it currently is. But certainly in the UK, there is interest in energy storage, and certainly I would see the next three to four years quite a lot of uh, interest in that particular, um, you know, capability. So yes, energy storage, I think, is something very much for the future.